We are here with Mr. Anthony Sakharopoulos from uh, Comscore. Mr. Sakharopoulos, uh, welcome to Webit. And can you please share your impressions about the event? Sure. Well, thank you very much. And on behalf of Comscore, I want to thank you and the rest of the organizers for having us here. Um, what struck me is how aggressive and uh, enthusiastic you and your staff are about growing and developing the digital business uh, here in Bulgaria and across the Central European and Eastern European area. And it's something that, obviously based on my presence here as well as others on the panel, other attendees, I think also highly value. Thank you. Which are the most important emerging trends in the digital metrics and how do you see the future? I think there are quite a few uh, emerging trends and uh, specific issues, but just to go back to the topic of the last discussion, uh, we at Comscore strongly feel that this reliance on the click and the click-through rate is at this stage in our trajectory, and by that I mean our internet trajectory is materially holding us back from a lot of spending that we, again, as an industry, are leaving on the table. And it's something that we're working very, very hard with our clients across the entire ecosystem system as well as with industry bodies and whatnot to try and address. Okay, do you think there is better alternative for the CTR model of measurement of the banner adver advertising? There's, there, is, there are better metrics, but again I come back to the adage that the metrics have to be consistent with the campaign. And by that I mean for certain campaigns the click-through rate is absolutely the right metric. For certain other campaigns, and I come back to what I just said about branding, there are other better metrics, such as whom did you reach? What was the ad visible? In which country are these people living? Uh, what was the content adjacency? Did the exposure to the ad drive any brand building metrics from an attitudes or persuasion or intention standpoint? And lastly, of course, was the ad effective? In other words, what was the ROI of exposure to that display campaign? And these are metrics that, again, collectively speaking, we as an in industry are grossly, grossly underutilizing. And I come back to what I said earlier, that this is, in our opinion, one of the key issues that are holding back our collective growth opportunities. Thank you. And where, according to you, is the presence of Comscore in Europe and uh, in Central and Eastern Europe in particular? So as you may have heard, we recently acquired Netstat, the Dutch web analytics company, almost two months ago. And while they're based in Amsterdam, what they immediately give us is a geographic presence across much of Western Europe. We've also invested in staff. Uh, within within Turkey over the last year and what we intend on doing is pursuing a regional slash hub strategy of development not only across Western Europe but across Eastern Europe as well and again if we can collectively work to increase the valuation of the online industry which I, I think within Central and Eastern Europe there is a tremendous opportunity you'll see more of a Comscore presence here Thank you very much. It's such a pleasure to have you here, and we hope we see you next year again. I hope so, too. Thank you very much. Thank